Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Teacher Christine of 5-1 Talk. Today teachers, I'm going to teach you how to use support portal which you can find the link in your my page home profile. So if you have some concerns that you want to address or you want to email it to 5-1 Talk, pwede niyo tong gamitin. Concerns like lesson-related, teacher-related, student, technical-related, AC, low bookings, and many other concerns, pwede niyo tong gamitin na din. Okay, so saan ba yun makikita, teachers? You can just find it here in your my page home profile right side. Ito siya. Paano ba siya gamitin? You only need to highlight this one. And then, copy. Mag-open ka ng another browser. Alright. And then, paste it here. Yan. And then, enter. So, kailangan mong mag-re-login. The same way that you log in in your my page. Sign in. Right. So, ito yung unang makikita natin as we enter the support portal of 5-1 Talk. So, we can see here five tabs. Guidelines, announcements, FAQs, tickets, and forums. Okay, so let's start with the guidelines. So, dito maraming mga categories, teachers, that you can able to read on so you can learn more about the Platform. Say, for example, dito, uh, just click on this plus sign para makikita mo yung subtopics niya. Okay, so as you click on before lesson, so mayroong maraming mga topic dito na pwede mong basahin so you can learn more about it. So you just need to click on read more para makapasok ka sa mga subtopics na ito. Okay, so again, Find time to read on this particular categories because you will be learning more about this. Alright? Then, we also have here announcements. So, pwede nyo rin itong makita dun sa dito, teachers. Kung anong nakikita nyo dito sa what's new, makikita nyo rin siya dito sa announcement. So, yung mga latest announcement like, Wow! Ito, we already have our new payment method. Okay, so our frequently asked questions about the the GCash and the PayPal. Kasi pwede na palang ipasok yung ating salary through GCash. Yun. So you just click on read more. At saka mayroon pang maraming announcements dito. Okay? So that is under announcements. Alright. Now, let's go to frequently asked questions. Kikita natin yung mga frequently asked questions ng teachers. Like, you want to talk tarpaulin. Nandito pala yung link. Uh, at saka marami pang iba. Like, how to use the grab lesson, lesson memo posting deadlines, and many more. So, let's now go to tickets because this is the main focus of our video today. As you click on tickets, kita mo tong create ticket. Una ko pa lang nagamit itong create ticket teachers nung gusto kong i-update yung aking bank setting. So aside from the bank setting we have in my page, gusto ko kasing ma-inform si 51 Talk through email na nakapost na ako ng bank setting sa aking my page. Para talagang sigurado akong papasok na yung sweldo ko. So, paano ba to gamitin? So we have here support type and concern. So, if your concern is about fee, is, let's say, mayroong kang lesson na hindi nagtatak ang payment doon sa lesson fee summary. So, pwede rin dito kayo sa under fees category. Okay. So, as you click fees, uh, so you can see here, submit ticket. What concern do you have related to your lesson fees? So, so as you click on this, Pwedeng bank information, pwedeng remittance concern like mayroon kang klase na hindi nakatatak yung lesson fee doon sa lesson summary. So, pwede ka dito sa remittance concern. Right? Then, main concern, you have to attach a file. So, yung mga screenshot ninyo. Kung sa bank account naman, yung deposit slip. And then, total amount being disputed. So, like sa akin, yung accumulated lesson fee na gusto kong i-claim. Yung inilagay ko dito. And then, send. 
Okay? So, that is if your concern is regarding fees. Makakapasok pa dito, teacher. Okay? Now, what if hindi naman regarding fees yung iyong concern? So, we still have technical help desk. Under technical desk, mayroon ka namang pagpipilian. AC issue, issue dispute follow-up, dispute validation. Hindi ko lang masyadong ma-explain ano to, teacher. But when you speak of dispute, you are claiming something you disagree or you are trying to discuss or you want to follow up something. Okay? Aside from technical desk, we also have home-based teacher lesson support. Yung related concerns naman dito mag-iiba. Ano ba yung concern mo? Is it about general concerns? Kasi kung hindi nakalagay dito, doon ka talaga sa others or general concerns. If your concern is about my page-related issues, leave, special plotting, attendance-related, feedback, Fees related, lesson related, locking and locking of page, my page promotion, fees agreement related, special project support and portal related, training related. So, jan, pwede kang pumili sa ang category ka na below. One time, I click on general concerns. Pwede rin siyang mabilong sa lesson related kasi I have a student who keep on booking my classes. Talagang apat na klase yung sunod-sunod niya na binubook. And then later on, kinakancel niya. So, sayang masyado. There are potential students who want to book those slots pero hindi na sila makapasok dahil nga nakabook na siya. Nagtitira lang siya ng isa. Kung minsan zero talaga. So, I really need to send my concern to 5-1 Talk. And then later on, nasolve naman siya. Yes. Again, pili ka lang doon sa categories where your concern belong to. And then, you will click here your teacher's name. I want to talk teacher official name natin. At saka yung rank natin dito. Then, you type here your mobile number. And then, your location here. Your title concern here. And then, your message here. If nakompleto mo na lahat, you just click on submit. Now, after you submit your concern, in 5 to 10 minutes' time, you will receive an email from 5-1 Talk, a feedback from Lesson Support. Just like this one. Okay, so yung unang makikita mo is this one, like LS tapos pangalan nag reply. Ayan. So, this is reply on 5-1 Talk Support, reply on other general concerns, frequent cancellation of Booking. So, kasi ito yung naging point ng aking email. So, yan yung kanilang naging reply sa akin. At saka, kung na-resolve na siya, they will send you another email saying, Your ticket has been resolved. Okay, so those are all for today. Thank you very much for watching this video. I hope that you have learned regarding support portal link in your My Page Home profile. So, gamitin nyo na siya so you can able to email your concerns to 51 Talk. Okay? So, if you find this video informative, please give it a big thumbs up. And of course, you can like and share this to others. And if you have not yet subscribed my channel, please don't forget to click on the red subscribe button and also hit on the notification bell so you will be notified whenever I have new video to upload. Thank you very much for watching this video. Always smile and God bless everyone.